Hi Griffin fans, Brittany Pietrangelo here with another segment of 60 Seconds With. And joining us today we have Lloyd Davis who is a left back on the men's soccer team. Lloyd is from Amonford, Wales and attended St. Michael's School. Thank you Lloyd for being here and joining us in this new series. It is no worries, I am uh, thankful to be here, honestly. <laughs> Well, let's get to know you a little better. Let's do it. Coming all the way from Wales, tell us what brought you here and how you heard about Seton Hill. Um, well, I was told about Dan McCarthy's Barmy Army, and um, so I Skyped with him for a bit, and he resold really the place to me. He said it was a great place, Catholic school, and uh, that really got me. And uh, he said I can study and play soccer, and obviously I can't really do that in the UK. I just had to pick one or the other. So uh, came to the, came to America to, to live the dream, so to speak, and here I am in Greensburg. We love to have you here. Um, so you graduate in 2020. Talk about your plans after you're done here. Do you plan on staying here, going back to Wales? Um, well, I do plan on staying here, if possible. It's quite hard to get a visa. I'm not sure if you're familiar with that. It's, uh, especially <laughs> sure with, with um, President Trump in charge, it, it's even more difficult. So uh, we'll see what happens there, but I'm not crossing my fingers yet. <laughs> so I feel like I have to ask you this, Lloyd. Can you elaborate on the similarities and differences between where you are from and the United States? Um, well, first of all, my house here is made of wood. That's, um, that's a strange one, because I can hear my neighbors do everything, which is great. Um, <laughs> apart from that, not too many differences. I mean, the people, they're friendlier. Yeah, food's a bit better. And honestly, I think it's just a nicer place to be, apart from where I live. It's a bit of a rough area, but apart from that, it's a great place. I agree with you on the food part. So. Your team is in the off-season right now, but you did play a game against U Duquesne last week and lost 1-0. to zero. What did you like from what you saw from your team and what didn't you like? Um, well, we, we played, um, we haven't played since last November, really, so it was the first competitive game for a lot of boys, and uh, I honestly thought we did really, really well. I thought we matched them. If not, we did, we probably played better than them for the, for the majority of the game, so it's a shame that we didn't get the result, but uh, honestly, the performance was there, and... Um, our attacking players, they look really sharp right now. So that's the, the main benefit from me. So it's a, a promising spring and hopefully an even better fall well, for the hopefully. team. Hopefully. So, all right, let's get to the fun part, Lloyd. We're going to put 60 seconds on the clock. Cut Are off. you ready? How much is on the clock? 60 seconds. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> all right, let's you go. ready? Yeah, let's go. All right, ready? Three, two, one. What is your favorite part about America? Rick from the calf. Great guy. <laughs> what is your favorite food in general? Uh, sheets, two for one hot dogs. <laughs> Give us some common American words that are said differently where you're from. Well, um, in the UK, we use grafter as someone who talks to girls and like is it just a smooth talker. Uh, in America, I think the phrase is Paulo de Souza. <laughs> United States or Wales? I'm a big fan of Wales, so I can't, can't go away from that, All unfortunately. Right. What is your favorite social media platform? Tinder. <laughs> what is your favorite American cuisine? The Indian curry on Wednesday nights in the calf. <laughs> Chelsea or Liverpool? Chelsea Rohan. Oh, no, Chelsea. Just Chelsea. <laughs> How does being an athlete make you a better person? You get um, better clothes, e.g. this. <laughs> Coffee or tea? I'm a big tea guy. All right. Well, boy, it looks like time is did I get, up. Did I get the points? Did I? Yeah. Oh, thank God for that. There you we go. Got, like, we'll say um, That's good. six points. Decent. All right. Decent. <laughs> well, thank you for joining us today, and I hope you had fun. It sounded like you did. Oh, mate. I honestly recommend anybody to try it. I well, heard your little jokes that you like to throw in there. <laughs> All right. And you guys just saw another 60 seconds with, with men's soccer player Lloyd Davis. Don't forget to follow Shoe Athletics on Twitter and Instagram. Davis. It's actually Davis. Oh, no! Like, low-key, yeah. Yes. Because, like... It's spelled Davies, you're right. And like everyone in America says Davies, I don't correct them. It's but Davis. Like, back home. And I know that because I have no. an English friend that has the same last name. I won't even look at these. Oh, oh you can look at them. <laughs> oh, this is, this is great. Hey, do I look good? Catch the griffins on deck. What? Lloyd says I'm cultured. You did it wrong again. Is this like second base? Or? Yeah, why don't we have makeup people? Have you have a girl now, like, come on. I did yeah. do it, but then it was we raining today. When do we know when we're going? When I start. Okay, so oh, Jesus. Okay. <laughs> Almondford. Almondford. Yeah. That's Almondford. Yeah. Maybe more of an am. Um, am. Almondford. Yeah. Almondford. Yeah, that's perfect. Look at me, cultured. 
This is intense.